Hello everyone, my name is Luke uh, from JTX. Uh, I'm going to take a video with the uh, valet adjustment. Um, this engine is Mac 2006 uh, C7. And um, I need, I, I, what I need tool is, I need 16 mm and 17 mm and um, 5 millimeter Allen key. The filler gauge, filler gauge for the intake is um, 38, 0.38 millimeter, and for the exhaust is um, it says 64.64 millimeter, uh, which is uh, 25,000 inches for the exhaust and um, 15,000 uh, inches for the intake. So uh, what what we do is we uh, um, spin the the cranks and we found um, we set the pin on it and um, we know this is the cylinder one because um, the cylinder one uh, this is the top that center so the valve is. Um, is uh, we can move it, it's not tidy. So, this is the top that's in there, and cylinder 6 is overlap. This is overlap. So, what I'm going right now is uh, I'm gonna adjust this tube for cylinder 1 and cylinder 2 intake, and cylinder 3 exhaust, cylinder 4 intake, and uh, cylinder 5 uh, exhaust. And then we spin it 360 um, degree, which is um, cylinder six is top dash center, and cylinder one right here is overlap. And we go back from cylinder one exhaust. Oh, oh sorry, intake exhaust. Um, intake exhaust. So. I'm going to do it. I just lose it up, lose it up the nut already, and this is my in uh, intake to get ten thousand inches. Make sure you are not too tight on it. It's dragging. So. Hold it and tighten it. Test it again. This is my um 16 millimeter. So what I'm gonna do is tighten it. Okay. Make sure I test it again. All right, that's dragging. Pretty good. And exhaust. Oh my god. My exhaust is uh, twenty-five thousand inches. Hold on one second. Make sure it's not too tight and too loose, it's dragging like this. Alright, test it again. Alright, that's good. Um, now I'm adjusting cylinder one so 
like I said, um, intake exhaust, intake exhaust on ton 360 degrees. So that's how it is, man. Thank you, uh, thank you for watching my video, and um, yeah, that's it.